Today, the U.S. government holds 56.2 million acres of land in trust for various Indian tribes and individuals. Yet, many Native American landowners struggle for control over their lands. A century of discriminatory policies by the government has forced them off their lands while opening them up to non-Native farmers and ranchers. According to the Indian Land Working Group, over the past 100 years, the government has implemented their highest and best use management policy by leasing Indian lands to non-Indians. This continues today, as is evidenced by the fact that of the 9 million acres of trust land classified as agricultural, 6 million is leased to non-Indians. A leasing cartel has been created because Indian landowners have had limited access to information and resources necessary to use and manage allotted trust lands. Today, most native landowners would like to be living on and utilizing their lands, but lack vital information about their lands to take the first step. That has all changed for residents of the Pine Ridge Reservation in South Dakota. Now, members of the Oglala Sioux Tribe can access information about their lands using the Pine Ridge Land Information System, a free online tool developed by Village Earth and the Oglala Sioux Tribe Land Office with support from the Indian Land Tenure Foundation. With this system, tribal members can easily locate their lands using the search tool. See high resolution aerial photos of their lands. Overlay maps of the government leasing units. Assess the health of the land using updated satellite imagery. View the reservation boundaries as defined in the 1851 and 1868 treaties. And soon, we'll be adding other layers with cultural, health, economic, and natural resource information. With the Pine Ridge Land Information System, members of the Pine Ridge Reservation can take the first steps to regaining control of their lands and make better informed decisions that will affect future generations to come.